Welcome to the Truth of Yah. The Truth of Yah's board game's mission is to humble the world in the Truth of Yah. The Truth of Yah's board game's vision is to build up the poor man and woman in spirit. Many people are deceived by lies, deceits, frauds, pride, forward mouth, arrogance, and evil ways. The poor in spirit are attacked daily. The vision to build up the spirit is to cause people only to walk in the ways of Yahweh, just as his son Yahweh Shai and the prophets did, by not just speaking the word, but by putting every word Yahweh spoke into action. Into action. We're the sons of thunder Israelites, and it's our heart's prayer and desire that you all get the truth of your game. Use our discount code SOT for additional savings. Shalom. Shalom. All right, man, let's, let's play, man. Let's, let's get it, man. Let's get it going, man. Shalom, I'm Sister Mayan, um, a student ambassador for the Spiritual Midwifery Program. Spiritual Midwifery has changed my perspective in a positive way when it comes to birth work. It has made me confident that I'm taking on the role that the Most High has chosen me for. I feel as though it has provided me with the right tools to better serve my current clients as a doula and future clients as a midwife. What makes Spiritual Midwifery stand out more than other trainings and programs is that it's much much more personable. Just being able to learn with and learn from sisters that are like-minded brings out a level of closeness and spirituality that cannot be achieved by anything not ordained by the Most High. I can definitely feel his presence every time class meets. I would definitely recommend the program to other Hebrew women pursuing midwifery. It's such a joy to learn from another Hebrew sister and also have a community of sisters to learn with that face the same daily struggles that we face in life. Shalom, 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 family. First and foremost, I have to give all praises, all glory, and all honor unto the Most High God, Yahweh. Of course, I do so in the name of his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. It's your brother, Ariyala of Sakari. And I am excited to present to you, the nation of Israel, the official Hebrew Israelite Bible. Now, this has been the culmination of four long years of hard work, and it is available for purchase at HIBOfficialZion.com. Get yours today. How you think you gonna get my respect? How you a man that can't keep your own spirit in check? That's the difference from rookies and vets. I tend to focus on the game, they rather complain to the reps. But life not a game of scrimmage. You get both your legs broken thinking you standing on chef business. We talking truth, I'm the best witness. I'd rather die than be left in this world. Y'all wanna be left in it. <laughs> talking about the laws done away with it. Special material for our sisters, by our sisters. This is a Sons of Thunder exclusive platform focused on building, encouraging, uplifting, and engaging with the daughters of Zion. Here you'll find personalized and interactive content geared towards showing what it truly means to be a pillar of rest. Interviews, scripture breakdowns. words unto all Israel. Deuteronomy 76. Uh, Bring it out. It's the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7 and verse 6. Uh -huh. For thou art an holy people. For thou art an holy people. Holy uh -huh. means separate. Sure, sure, right? sure, to sure. be uh -huh. holy means to be set apart. Read. Unto the Lord thy God. Unto the Lord thy God. That's a possessive word. Right. Mm -hmm. Thy God. Read. The Lord thy God uh -huh. have chosen thee. Hey, the Lord of this Bible, the God of this Bible chose the Israelites, read. To be a special Let's people go. unto himself. Wait, well, you, there's something important you got to hear, though. I, I mean, I understand what you're saying. It just don't take me a long time to get around the block. So, so, let me, so let me ask you, what, what do these people have to do then? 
Because are you a Bible believer? What do what people have to do? These people in this book. Are you a believer in Christ? Now, how does one uh, get salvation? How does one receive eternal life? That's the question. Oh, you're asking me? I'm asking you. How does one receive eternal life? Yes. How does a man receive eternal life being a follower of Christ? Being born again. Being born again. What does it mean to be born again? What does that mean? Of water and of spirit. What does that mean? What? Does that mean? what? If I ask you. So, in the conversation that Nicodemus had with Jesus. Right. Jesus okay. Three. Jesus explained to him quite simply that being remember. born again was to be born of the water and of the spirit. Right. Which means mean? what? What does that mean? Does well, that, that means baptism. Go to as, Psalms. Says, but the thing is, I mean, you don't have to ask me questions if you have the answers. What? No, no I'm going to gauge and understand it. Yep, but you're not. You're, you're asking me questions, but you're telling him to go somewhere. So if you have the answer, then give me the answer that you have. But, but you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't, I can't ask you a question and then set you up, you know what I'm saying, with what I'm going to say. This hey, is church. He's not trying to make an example out of it. Oh, no, no, that's that, not. That's, 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 not, that's not reasoning. That's not what I'm He's not trying to do that. What? He's trying to see what you think. Well, the I'm, only thing I, I would see is, is with these eyes. The and what I can see is what you were telling him to do. Right. And the things that I can't see is, hey, is what your opinion is of the Bible. So no opinion, that's why I have to. Brother, I, never, I never said no opinion. I, I'm not. Listen, what I'm all simply doing is reasoning with you through the scripture. I want us to know what it is that you believe, right. and I don't want to assume your position. Right, right, right. But I understand so, that. But I'm saying you're not reasoning with me because you're you're asking me a question that you have prepared him to get right. So a reasoning is when you and I are having a conversation, and there is pure intentions to listen, so that we can draw reason, so that we can build, so that we can have a collective. Right, and that's reasoning. But if you're saying, what's salvation? You say, go to, and you give him the scripture, then it's already set up for what you're about to do. Now, what? I'll listen, you know what I'm saying? Okay. But that's not reason. All right, no, so you so started the conversation by saying, be born of the water and spirit. No, I and didn't. He, he, he asked started you, the conversation well, let me say by this. asking me, See how we have a difference salvation? of opinion, I ain't cut you up? He, he, he asked you, what does that mean? And you said, well, he said, I, can, I got a scripture that I think means being born of water and spirit, and he was gonna share it with you. He wasn't trying to uh, show you up. Because yeah. yes, I don't disagree I, with you. I never once said he was trying to show me up. You, know I mean? you said I was guiding the conversation, and then you gave scriptures. I wasn't guiding the conversation. This gentleman asked me. What I don't I mean it like you're. Do, I don't mean it like that. Let me say it so I don't offend you. I mean, you gave us an avenue because we were seeing what you think, and you brought up water and spirit. Well, you gave us a topic by saying that. So you guided us away. Simply. That's it. Simply. We're not trying to uh, embarrass nobody out here at all. Yeah, yeah. I, I, we, I promise we, you. We, we, like, we like conversations. So yeah, we, we don't want to be masters of the conversation by telling you this is what we're going to talk good. about. I just simply ask you, how does one receive salvation? Because as Christ believers, that's very important to us. Now listen, right. go. So Excellent. read that. Excellent. You want Psalms for us? Come read that Psalms first. It's the book of Psalms chapter 119 and verse 9. Uh -huh. Wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way? Right, so wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way, right? That means his doings upon this earth. Read it. By, by taking heed thereto according to thy word. By taking heed to what? Thy word. By taking heed to the word, read. With my whole heart have I sought thee. And with your, your mind, your whole strength, all your, your might, you seek after the Lord, read. Oh, let me not wander from thy commandments. And not wander away from what? Thy commandments. Not wander away from the Lord's commandments. Right. right? So that's, that's, we would agree when you said by spirit and by water, right? Because the rewashing is by the spirit. The rewashing is by keeping, taking heed to the commandments of God, right? This is the book of Ephesians, New chapter, Testament, chapter Read. five and verse twenty-six. Right, that he might sanctify and cleanse it by the washing of water. By, by the washing of what? A washing of water. Read by the word. By the what? By the word. So the washing of water is John by 15. the word. And what is the word? Oh, come read that first, and then get John, John six. Because this Read. makes that same. Point. So the washing of water is by the word. Yeah. Right. So there has to be a demonstration to what the washing is doing, right? Okay. So when you read, can you turn to Acts 2 for me? We can read this read, thing. Read Acts 2. Or y'all can read y'all, but it, 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 in, in order for there to be a dialogue, no, no, we, definitely. Acts of course. Two, we get to get the Acts yeah. 2. What? But which verse? Which, which verse? Acts 2 and 38. Get Acts 2 and 38. Read that. I read that earlier for a brother. 
It's the book of That's uh, good. It's the book of John chapter 15 and verse 3. Uh-huh. Now you are clean through the word. Through the what? Through, through the, the word. word. It said, now you are clean through the word. And what we read in Psalms and also in Ephesians is what the word does is it changes a man's way. Right. To uh -huh. keep the commandments of God. Read. Which I have spoken unto you. Which I have spoken unto you. So the word of the Lord, the Lord's commandments, washes a man if he takes heed to it. Yes. Right? Now look, now look, now yes. listen, brother, because this is a good conversation. And the elder says, so that's part of the baptism. Yeah. Because right. look, and that goes to the point, because this is a good conversation we have. Because in order for a man to be washed by the word, he has to take heed to it. Right? So that means that man has to make up within himself, I'm going to stop sinning and keep God's commandments. Right? Read that Acts 2. Because the book of Acts. Everybody got to go. Because he said a demonstration. So, so, so he said a demonstration is important. So, right? let's say I'm, I'm doing God's word. Uh -huh. Let's say that I'm reading the Bible and the scriptures. Uh -huh. Still, can I be guilty with God? Can you can you be uh, guilty of sin? That's what yes, you're asking. Yes. Even if you're following God's word, yes. command. Yes. A man who is a righteous man follows seven times. So, but but he gets back up. So if there, oh, right here. Right. Right. So if there was sin involved, uh -huh. then the sin has to be removed, right? Exactly. Yes. All right. And that remove or that remission comes from Christ. Christ. Is it right? And that remission comes from Christ. But how does it come through from Christ? How does it come from Christ? Mm -hmm. By his sacrifice. By his sacrifice. Okay. Romans chapter, uh, chapter so, 8. So in, in Acts 2 and 38. Come on, brother. Right. Now come around this the book of come Acts chapter 2 and verse 38 for the brother. Uh -huh. It says, Then Peter said unto them, could, Repent and be baptized, okay, every one of you, in but, the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of sin, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. What? So. Can you give me an understanding to what that means? All right, read it again. This is the book of Acts, chapter 2, verse 38. Uh -huh. Then Peter said unto them. The rock of the church said this, read. Repent. They do what? Repent. Man. Now, what does it mean to repent? Turn, to turn away from what? Sin. And what's sin? First right John, First John, chapter 3 and 4. It's the book of first. Transgression. It's the book uh -huh. of first John. Transgression, right? That's right. It's the book of first John, chapter three and verse four. Uh-huh. Whosoever committeth sin. Whosoever committeth what? Sin. sin. Read. Transgresseth also the, the law. law. That means you broke the law, read. For sin, sin is, is the transgression of the, of the law. Because to sin is to break God's commandments. Right. Right? So, so, so oh wait, I'll, I'll, I was gonna give you finish getting my understanding. Hey man, I love you, bro. I gotta go though. I appreciate you. Keep, keep, yeah. Well, yeah. Did, you, well did you understand what? I mean, in order for there to be a conversation, both people have to to speak. And you, and, you feel and, like I was stepping on your toes, I'm sorry. I don't, my don't, brother. I don't feel like you were stepping on my toes because there's not an agreement don't mean that something was wrong. You know what I'm saying? You weren't stepping on my toes. You didn't let finish though. You didn't let me start. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know that you no, were giving your understanding. Because you, you said, you said, read this scripture. We read it and then you said, what's your understanding? That's what he was doing was giving your understanding. Right. Understanding. But I'm just saying at, at some point, like see how this dialogue is going on? There has to be an exchange. If not, it's just, it's not a conversation. There, there, was, there, was, there was an exchange. Hey, bro, listen. he want to talk. Huh? What? I, that's what I'm saying. I, I, I'm going to say, you go ahead. I'm gonna say go ahead. this. That's what he want. We, we all brothers, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and it's, it's nothing wrong. Out of the million things to do, you guys are standing on this corner trying to win our people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I have no no enemy against that. Yeah, I love you guys. You know what I'm saying? I just I just got to go. You know what I'm saying? It's, just, it's nothing bad. Yeah. Hey, give him a fuck. Yeah, it's in my bag right here. So, all we do is this. Because you never know, he might have talked to other brothers. They might have been abrasive. You know, bro, this, listen. This, the Hebrew Israelites, bro, uh, it's just been crazy. The experience, it, bro. Hopefully, we some. I was in Cleveland, Ohio once, bro, and I was. Dude. I know how it can be. Sometimes it can be like a dictatorship. Yeah. But there's very, a brother from uh, St. Louis. Um, they think his name is Shams or something. Y'all know how this brother? Not familiar. No. What, what camp? Brother, what body? I don't know, man. He just, he's a true representation, bro, of like, of somebody who loves God. Like, so, how like, you I'm, feel about these young brothers talking? Man, listen, bro, I, I will trust them with my address. Hey, I'll praise, praise this. I'll praise this. And the most I do the rest. Because it's not, it's not. I, you know what I'm saying? 
it's not a bad thing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I can tell that you guys are good by just talking to you and, and seeing your genuine concern. You know what I'm saying? And that's, that's a great thing. It's just that my wife and my son. Yeah, yeah. Understand. They, they was here and I don't know where they at, bro. And I got to find them. But, um, just, just keep doing it. But you wasn't Brother Word's nephew? Brother who? Brother, 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 where did you left? Nah, because he was saying. <laughs> yeah. He said he was looking for his nephew. He was looking oh, for his nephew. Well, what were you about to say? But, um, that's it, man. You know, guys, right? Right. What? What's your name again? Noki. 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 Brother Noki. I'm nice to meet you, my brother. I'm Durant. Nice to meet you. I'm Did you get the flyer? Nice to meet you, bro. Yeah, he got yeah, it. Yeah, I got it. That's that's that right, the front, that's our YouTube channel, right? And then on the back, we have a conference call every Friday at 8.30. Right, we have eight, we have a lesson in the beginning, but afterwards we answer any question anybody has. Yeah. Any question, right? If you like, you know, you want to email us on anything, we, we do we do marriage councils and things like that, that nature for the people. That's got any ideas and things, then email us at sons of at gmail.com. We can build for it. You stay in the city? I don't. Okay, kind of. Where, what state you about? Ohio. Ohio? Ohio? Wow. That what, brother, what part he of used Ohio? to be in Ohio. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 They used to be out there in my home. They met you Ohio. teaching Ohio? Well, we taught in Columbus, Ohio. Yeah. And, and Ohio. Okay. And we used to teach up here in Ohio. And in Columbus, Ohio. What time is like y'all out here? It's wild. 3 p.m. Yeah. 3 p.m. Yeah. 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 It's every, every, every Sabbath. Open late. Every Sabbath. Like, 5 o'clock in the morning. Stuff is just now shutting down. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Of course, brother. Hey, now, now, brother uh, Noki, you gave us a good topic to talk about. You, want to say something, no. you gave us a good topic to talk about because a lot of people ask us that question. Right, like, Be what's safe. important is is Have a blessed being, day. is being dumped into the water. Is That's that so important for my salvation? That's true. And what we but what we tell people is what's important for your salvation is the renewing of the word. Now, if you want to be baptized in water, that's fine. That's not. So you don't think it's like an element that has to be? No, I don't. It's not necessary. It's not necessary for salvation. So when you're reading Acts two and thirty eight, and it says for the remission of sin, right? So you don't think that a person has to be baptized well, for the remission of sin? Well, see, but but we showed you what that baptism is. Saying. So well, we went to Ephesians. Uh, go to that again, right? Well, we read in Ephesians, and then we'll read uh, Acts two and thirty eight again, right? We read in Ephesians is what that uh, baptism is, what that washing is. Right? Read that for me. Bring it out. Uh. This is the book of Ephesians, chapter five, and verse twenty-six. Uh -huh. It says that He might sanctify right. and cleanse it. To sanctify means to cleanse, right? With the washing of water. With the washing of what? Water. Washing of water. By, what? By the word. By the word. So the washing of water comes by the word, because when we read Revelation chapter twenty-two, it tells you what that that water is. Uh, I believe it's in John as well. Christ tells you the uh, the John chapter four, four or six, where Christ tells you what that water is, the water that proceeds out the belly of, of, of man. That's right. Six he who believes on me, as the scripture says, out of his belly shall flow rivers of what? Living, Living water. water. Six and right? six. Right. So that of which water. Which man will drink and never thirst. Which man will drink and never thirst, and we know that's the word of God. So well, we I got a precept. Come read that precept first. This is this is Matthew. That in John. This is Matthew three and eleven. This is John the Baptist on Christ, right? Uh huh. He says, "I indeed mm, baptize good. you with water unto repentance, but he that cometh after me is mightier than I, whose shoes I'm not worthy to bear. Mm -hmm. He shall baptize you with the Holy Spirit mm -hmm. and with fire." Mm -hmm. Now my question, my question with you would be, John the Baptist indeed did a water baptism. But he's saying he that coming after me is better than me, whose shoes I'm not even worthy to hold. He's going to baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. What is that? Are we really going to go through? Are we going to be people running through flames? Right? I would ask what, 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 would, what, what would that be? That spirit, that fire. Um, it's talking about the, the actions that took place in Acts 2 again. When they were in the upper room mm -hmm. and the Holy Ghost was given to them. And that's what he's talking about. Okay. That's what you said. Talking about the, 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 the clothes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The clothes. Fire. The clothes and tongues. The clothes and tongues, right? Yeah. The clothes and, and, and tongues. The fire that was over. So that's what he did because you understand when John the Baptist was talking, he set the stage for Jesus. Yeah. Right? And in doing that, he was also telling what Jesus was doing. He was saying, this is what I'm out here doing. I'm baptizing. Yeah. But the one that's coming is going to give you the Holy Ghost. Yes. Right? Baptized with the Baptized Holy Spirit. With the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. So, so what? 
what is the spirit? No, no, he, yeah, the person, yeah, yeah, we got what his, no, What he just read, we actually we just, was reading it. Yeah, yeah. What he just said. Read, go ahead, read it, John. Let me oh, get God, my family. Hey. Hey. Yes, sir, y'all be easy. Hey, you as well, my brother. Yes, yes sir, brother. Brother Noki. Brother Noah? Noki. Noki, brother Noki. Okay. Shalom. Have a good one. All right, have a good one. All right, read that. It's the book of John, chapter 1, starting at verse... 30. Uh -huh. This is he of whom I said, after me cometh a man which is preferred before me. Hey, after me cometh a man which is pre preferred above me, read. For he was before me. Right. And I knew him not, but that he should be made manifest to Israel. Right. This is John the Baptist. Right. Man who baptized men through water, read. Therefore, I am come baptizing with water. I'm coming baptizing with water, read. And John bare record saying, I saw the Spirit descending from heaven like a dove. Hey, the, John, the, John the Baptist said, I saw the Spirit descending from heaven, read. And it abode upon him. Read. And I knew him not, but he that sent me to baptize with water, mm -hmm. the same said unto me, upon whom thou shalt see the Spirit descending and remaining on him, the same is he which baptizes with the Holy Spirit. And that's talking about Christ. That yeah. man is the one who baptized with the Holy Spirit. Right. Now, John, now John the Baptist told you that he's greater than me, which means what? His ministry shall be greater. And right. his way and must his way increase. His increase and mine decrease. decrease. Right? Uh, it's like, what? John, John the, the Baptist, uh, Acts 2 and 38. Because John the Baptist was what? A baptism unto repentance through water. Right. Right. So what they were doing was showing that they were changing by the way of them going underwater the and then coming up. That yes, ceremony. Because what do they have to do first? They, they, have, to they, have, to they have to change. And that's what Christ is. Christ, yeah. Christ solely right. is going under, he's, he's going to change you. It's uh -huh. going, that demonstration isn't going to be by going through uh -huh. water. That demonstration is going to be you changing your ways. Right. Once being a wicked Negro, to being an Israelite, a prince in the power of God. Who keeps the commandments. Yeah, that's right. Read that, John 3 and 30, 38, 2 and 38, because what the brother was going to John 2 and 38 was to show that being dunked in the water is essential for your salvation. Right. That is a ritual that must happen in order for you to receive the kingdom. Right? right? Read that. So book of Acts chapter 2 and verse 38. Uh -huh. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized. Every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins. Hey, the remission of sins come through baptism. Yeah. But what is that baptism? Read it again. Then Peter said unto them, repent. Do what? Repent. Repent. The key word is repent. Right. Now how does a man, how does a woman repent? You stop sinning. Right. Hey, y'all come here to worry. Sin is a transgression of the of, of the law, right? Sorry. Right? What, what? What, hey, what's your name? Tyson. Hey, before Tyson. you get to them, brother tried to make you an offender for a word. Oh, he tried to make yeah, me an offender. Yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he tried. <laughs> he tried yeah. hard. <laughs> right? Uh, the brother's back. Yeah. Brother Nico. Right? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> All right, can't find him? He's right there. there. He out of you. So, so listen, what's your name again? Tyson. 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 What's, your, what's your name in the back, brother? Kyle. Kyle. Cameron. 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 Now let me ask y'all something. Well, first off, what 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 y'all doing? Like, what's the camera? I just taking pictures. Taking pictures. Taking pictures. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So let me ask y'all something. Y'all believe in Christ? Yes. You believe in Christ? What y'all? What y'all right. nationality? Ethnic background. See my Okay. Uh, just. Mm -hmm. German. 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 Y'all are siblings? Uh, oh no. You. What's your? Dominican. 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 By who? Mother or father? Simeon. Mother and father. Hey, my brother. Your father, all right? So look, y'all believe in Christ? Yes. Now, we teach the Bible, right? And when we teach the Bible, we teach what's in the Bible. We're called solo scriptura. That means we don't teach nothing that is outside of the, like, the Bible. If the Bible don't teach it, we don't teach it. Right. right? Concerning, concerning Bible. For doctrine, right? Go to Matthew uh, 15. In 24, and uh, you had a precept? No, we were talking about offender for you. Oh, oh, okay, God. <laughs> no, 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 lie. Uh, Matthew 15, 24, right? Now, Christ, Christ came for the people, right? Right. As Christ followers, we ought to follow His example, and He died for our sins, right? Now, who did Christ die for? Us. Well, be specific. Like everybody, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, we read something in the Bible 
that says otherwise. Read that. It's the book of Matthew, chapter next, 15, and verse 24. What color are the words? Red letter. Now, what does it mean when the, the, the words are red? It means Christ is speaking. Jesus, okay, you next, too. Jesus you is speaking, him. right? Read. But no, he's him. But, him, but he you, answered and you, said. What did Christ say? But he answered and said, uh -huh. I God, am God. not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Now, Christ said he's not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. That's what it says. What does that mean? So if I say, yo, I'm on a car lot, and, I, and you tell me, hey, I want you to buy all these cars on this lot, right? And I tell you, I'm not here but to buy a Bugatti. I'm not here for a Camaro. I'm not here for nothing else but a Bugatti. I'm not here for nothing else but a Bugatti. What am I saying? I just want a Bugatti, right? Christ said this, read, read it again. But he answered and said, I am not sent. I'm not sent. But unto the lost sheep. But unto the lost sheep, read. Of the house of Israel. Of the house of Israel. All right. So, Somebody said, Christ, come here and save everybody. Christ said, I am not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. You're right. A lot so of people don't know that. People don't know that. Now, as Christ followers, that's important for us to know. We must know what Christ taught and what his example was. Exactly. He said he was only sent for the Israelites. Thank you for watching. You can support the body via Cash App or PayPal. You can also support the channel by joining our Patreon for exclusive videos and content that can't be found anywhere else. We're the Sons of Thunder. It's our heart's prayer and desire for Israel that they might be saved. Shalom.